Hello, everybody. Happy Monday. It is the 21st of February, which means there's less than a day before the Witch Queen is released. It's finally here. Six months of waiting, and we are finally at that release date. There's a lot of hype that's been happening. There's a lot of lore that's been dropped, and it is building up to this momentous occasion of probably the biggest and most ambitious expansion we've seen so far for Destiny 2. I know for us here at Omni, we have been incredibly excited and we've been speculating for weeks on what we're going to be expecting, what's going to happen to, you know, some of the characters around the tower. Maybe some of the uh, the Vanguard leaders are going to be killed, like maybe Ikora might, uh, might venture too far into the throne world and get killed off. We'll see. Um, I'm pretty sure a lot of people are uh, speculating similar thoughts. Maybe I'm just saying it improperly, but I, I'm, to be honest, I'm just too excited. I can't contain myself. The purpose of this video, though, is to give people a insight about how the tomorrow's launch is going to happen. Uh, for those that have not participated in a launch event like this, we will be covering that in just a second. But for those of you that have participated, you can either skip this section or uh, just skip the video entirely because that's kind of all we're going to be talking about. But if you have and you just want to keep watching, go for it. We do have some announcements towards the end we want to cover, especially with uh, some stuff on the Twitch side, just so that way if you want to just chill with us, hang with us and, you know, talk about Witch Queen uh, and stuff of that sort, definitely stick around a little bit longer. For those of you that are new to the release days, this is how it's going to go. Usually the day prior, they shut the servers down, which at 6.45 p.m. PST today, uh, that'll be 8.45 p.m. for a central time, folk. Uh, the servers will be brought offline, uh, and about 15 minutes after that, the preload for the Witch Queen will drop. So just make sure you have that downloaded and ready to go for tomorrow, because those of you on the slower internet might want to take Take advantage of that time window so that way you're not stuck updating right when witch queen starts or you're not done when witch queen is launched i know i've had to deal with preloading and downloading the update right as soon as the expansion launch and then you miss out on all the fun stuff right at the beginning however you do miss all, all of the uh the issues and the long load times kind of right in the beginning, uh, which is what you kind of want to expect, especially with the amount of preloads, uh, not preloads, but the uh, pre-orders, my apologies, uh, that we got for this specific expansion. Over 1 million people have pre-ordered this expansion. That is incredible. That is the biggest number I've seen so far that I can remember for this game. And honestly, I'm proud of all the people that have chosen to uh, keep playing, uh, even with all those dead Destiny, dead game memes that we've had for countless years. It's finally happening. The biggest expansion so far, and I'm excited. I can't wait. There's so much going on, so much to dive into. Back to the times starting tomorrow, 9 a.m. PST or 11 a.m. CST. Uh, the servers will be brought back online. Long load times are to be expected as well as some server instabilities. By uh, 10 a.m. or 12 p.m. CST, the maintenance is scheduled to be complete, but they might have some emergency maintenance if the servers crash again. And with that kind of out of the way, uh, back to those announcements that I had mentioned earlier, we are streaming the Witch Queen tomorrow. We're streaming at 10.30 CST. We are um, gonna be go over one of Bife's new videos that he released today. Uh, regarding some Witch Queen stuff, I think he released his own like little mini short uh, of sorts. I have not looked at it, but I did see the trailer and it looks incredible. And uh, I'm just excited to see that this uh, little lore retelling he has chosen to bring out. So if we don't see you at twitch.tv uh, slash Omnipixel Gaming tomorrow, uh, link will be in the description for that, by the way. Um, we hope that you have a fun time playing the Witch Queen and that uh, hopefully you get to enjoy it spoiler free. I know we're staying away from Twitter. We're staying away from the social medias. Uh, if we do see some Witch Queen spoiler comments or posts, either in this video or in our Discord, they will get removed if they aren't in the proper channels uh, and specifically here on the channel if we do see it. Just to keep those uh, people who don't want to see them spoiler free, completely spoiler free. So that way they don't, uh, they don't have anything ruined before they get to it. With that, we hope you have a great rest of your night. We'll see you tomorrow uh, in game and just enjoy it. Take your time. Don't try to rush things. Experience it for all it's worth because I'm honestly, it's it feels overwhelming. If you want to hear more from us or you just want to give us some support, feel free to hit that subscribe button. Uh, if it's red, click it. Make sure it's grayed out as well as hit that like button. Let us know how we're doing and as well as hit that bell icon so that way you're notified of any future videos that we do, as well as some new projects we're gonna be having out. There might be an unboxing or two somewhere in there that you get to see. But with that, we bid you farewell and we'll see you tomorrow.